This video reviews how to draw a line given an equation, in this case y equals 2x minus 1. And we want to draw this line between the values of 0 and 4 on the x-axis. Now there are lots of ways of doing this. The most basic way of doing it, which will always work, is to use a table of coordinates. So if I put x, 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4, I can then find the y values for each of these given x values by using the equation. So, when x is 0, y equals 2 times 0, which is 0, take away 1, which is minus 1. When x is 1, 2 times 1 is 2, take 1 is 1. I keep on going. 2 times 2 is 4, take 1 is 3. 2 times 3 is 6, take 1 is 5. 2 times 4 is 8, take 1 is 7. So these are the y coordinates for any given x coordinate. So when x is 0, y is minus 1. When x is 1, y is 1. When x is 2, y is 3. When x is 3, y is 5. And when x is 4, y is 7. Normally, of course, you would have graph paper for this sort of question. I then draw a line through those coordinates, which I extend about the way through, and there we go. This is the line y equals 2x minus 1 for x from 0 to 4. Now there is another way of doing this which does not involve a table of coordinates. Now then, if you've got an equation, then the number you add or subtract is always the y-intercept. So I could have put the value minus 1 on the y-axis straight away. So there we go. This value here, the number before the x, the coefficient, is always of the gradient. And a gradient of 2 means across 1, up 2, across 1, up 2. So I could have gone across 1, up 2, across 1, up 2, across 1, up 2, and put the dots on in that way, and then draw the line through them. Both methods give the same line at the same coordinates.